The Nigerian Senate has called on the German government to collaborate with its Nigerian counterparts in the areas of security and power to enhance the social political development of Nigeria. President of the Senate, Senator Gatla Kwabu, made the call while he received in Kotsi the German ambassador to Nigeria, Annette Gunter, in his office on Wednesday. Mariam Zakari has details. Receiving the German ambassador in his office, the Senate President Gottwille Fabio urged the German government to take more active part in resolving conflicts in areas such as Ukraine, the ongoing Palestinian-Israeli war in Gaza, and the rising spate of insecurity in some parts of Nigeria. The world needs peace, Germany needs peace, we need peace for any meaningful development. I would like to bequeath to our to future generations a peaceful world. You know, where one can move around without let or hindrance. On the security situation in Nigeria, we are uh, taking it very seriously. Uh, it's not as if it is worsening. I believe that with more companies coming to establish here and creating more employment opportunities, a lot of uh, our children will be gainfully employed. He pledged better synergy between the Nigerian parliament and that of Germany to strengthen the already existing ties between the two countries on the planned repatriation of over 12,000 illegal immigrants in Germany back to Nigeria. The Senate president asked that officers of the Nigerian immigration should be invited to Germany to identify if all of them are truly Nigerians. As a result of the current situation in Mali, Niger and uh, Burkina Faso, Almost every black person in Germany who want to say I'm a Nigerian because they will not want to go back to their countries that are now crisis poor. So they always want to say that we are, they are Nigerians. And so if you dump 12,000 uh, illegal immigrants on Nigeria, it will escalate the insecurity situation in Nigeria. Earlier, the German ambassador, Ernest Grothen, commended the Senate for the recent resolution to meet with service chiefs over the security situation in Nigeria, hoping that a lasting solution would be found. As far as um, the northeast of Nigeria is concerned, um, actually we are quite engaged there. And you know about our stabilization uh, efforts there, um, together with UNDP. Uh, for instance, we have rebuilt the one famous, <laughs> in, meanwhile famous village of Ngaranam, um, where it has been completely destroyed in 2015 or 16 by Boko Haram. People had fled, and then it was the territory was regained, the village was rebuilt. There's a little health station there, there's a school there, there's a police po post, and the people have, uh, re I was there myself, they have returned, the families, uh, the women, the children, they were given money, uh, they were given a piece of cattle or, or whatever, so they have returned, and that's what we call stabilization. You know? She highlighted areas Germany would want collaboration with the Nigerian government. President uh, no, Chancellor Scholz has a... Uh, um, proposed to President Tinubu that we invite at our own cost two people from the immigration service to come and live in Germany to work there together with the embassy to do the identification so that you can be sure there will no be you know you know Burkina Faso or other people you know? um, so this we are aware, we have made this, we still have to agree on the technical details, but it's on the table. I talked to the Minister of Interior and I think this is something we can do and that we will do. So you can be relaxed about this issue. Mariam Zakari, ADBN News.